fear factor. Each show, six contestants from around the country battle each other in three extreme stunts. These stunts are designed to challenge the contestants both physically and mentally. If a contestant is too afraid to complete a stunt, they're eliminated. If they fail a stunt, they're eliminated. But if they succeed, they move one step closer to the grand prize. $50,000. Six contestants, three stunts, one winner. Fear Factor. I'm Joe Rogan, and this is Fear Factor. The stunts you're about to see were all designed and supervised by trained professionals. They are extremely dangerous. It should not be attempted by anyone, anywhere, anytime. but totally excited about this. Everybody, they all look like they're in superb shape. I feel like I'm the littlest one here when I stand beside them, and I just want to go out there and give it my all. I feel like I'm the little engine that could. I'm not holding anything back. I want to get paid. I want those 50 Gs in my pocket. I want the money, the fame, the fortune, and everything that comes with it. I consider myself what most people would consider a cowboy. There's rodeo cowboys, there's are working cowboys, and there's the guys that dress the part. I still do rodeo a little bit, I still rope. I take pride in calling myself who I am, you know, whether it's a cowboy or a redneck or whatever, you know, that's just me. I'm a winner, plain and simple. I'm willing to do anything to prove myself. I've never applied for a job that I haven't gotten. I've never competed in anything where I haven't been number one. I just know I'll do well on the show. I played competitive tennis, water polo, baseball. I've always been in sports, always been in competition. And it's not just sports, it's style, the way you walk. Everything is a competition. This isn't something that I would normally do, but now that I am here, I'm very interested to see how far I can go. I'm not competitive, I'm not into sports, but if you want to play games, we can play games. Uh, all right, you six people have been brought here from all over the country for one reason, to stare fear in the eye as you compete for $50,000. Now to win the money, you're gonna have to complete three extreme stunts. Stunts that will not only test you physically, but mentally as well. If you are too afraid to attempt a stunt, you'll be eliminated. If you try a stunt but fail to complete it, you are gone. But if you do succeed, you will move on to the next round and be that much closer to the cash. All right, ready to see your first stunt? Absolutely. It's over 350 feet from this side of the dam to the other. You'll each have five minutes to collect as many flags as you can. If you fall off, the amount of flags that you've collected will be your total. The two men and the two women that collect the most amount of flags in five minutes will move on to the next round. The others will be eliminated. We've randomly selected who gets to go first. And Myla, you are lucky number one. Me. All right, come on, come on. Let's see what you got. Woo! You ready, Myla? Oh, yes, I'm ready. It's really, really high. There. Who do you think is your biggest threat out of these freaks? Uh, you know what? I don't really feel like I have any um, competition down really? there. No, You're just going to no. win, right? I'm just going to win. That's exactly really? where I'm in the zone right now, and that's where I'm staying. It's time to shine, baby. I'm glad I'm going shine. first. <laughs> <laughs> are you ready to do this? I'm ready to do this. Now remember, you are setting the bar. So you got to go gangbusters. That's right. That's right. I'm going in. I have to tell you, 
because you're a gamer. You're going to win this whole thing, right? Winning. All right, All right. let's get you harnessed up. Let's do it. Right. She's yeah. falling down. That one? She's, She's going to fall. fall. <laughs> Listen to them. I can hear them talking. She's oh. annoying. She's annoying? Can I get a drink of my water? <laughs> Someone. I can quit smoking. I can do anything. All you gotta do is set your mind to it because I think this is definitely more a mental game. I can win. All right, Molly, you ready? Let's do it. Here we go. You got five minutes in three, two, one, go. Ah, oh, this rope is hot. Take it easy. Come on, girl, you got it. Don't look down, you fool. <laughs> ah. All right, Woo! Ah. Yeah, she got one. Yeah. <laughs> You're a minute and a half in. She, she really done a lot better than that, so. Cause I don't know if I can handle high maintenance tomorrow. <laughs> Let's get her. We both gotta get her. <laughs> we have to. She set the mark. Yep. Just like Cowboy here is gonna have to set the mark for the guys. <laughs> yeah, that's good, yeah, you guys exactly. All right. Well, let's give it up for Mario. Congratulations. Right? You surprised us. Show them the hands. So, who talked the most stuff? Oh! Uh, <laughs> okay, we all did. Let me feel your hands, honey. Wow. Oh, they're nice and soft. You ain't gonna be soft no more. Wow. All right, Miley got eight. Give me a prediction. What are you gonna do? Nine or more. The wind's blowing really bad. So that's bad your prediction. There. Nine or more. I'm hoping. Let's I mean, go. All I can do is hope. I'm on. Good luck. Pray for you guys. Do it, AJ. All right. Hands burning. Yes, very much. Did yeah. you feel unbalanced with your feet? Not really. So your feet were good. It was just your hands. Yeah, you'll see when you get up there. All right, AJ. How you feeling? Nervous. You nervous? I'm nervous. Come on, why are you getting me nervous? You're gonna win this thing, right? I wanna win. You just saw Myla do it, and she's nothing. That's what you said. I think I can go faster than her. You think you can go faster than her? I think I can. The wind's an issue, too. You guys don't understand. It's different up there and over there. It's different. I am moving on to the next round. <laughs> I'm going to the next round. I'm gonna kick your butt, Myla. I'm really, really scared to do this. I mean, I keep looking down. It's so far. I do not wanna fall. All right, AJ, here we go. If you get nine, you all in three, two, one, go! Yeah! Oh. It's over 350 feet from this side of the dam to the other. The two men and the two women that collect the most amount of flags in five minutes will move on to the next round. All right, AJ, here we go. If you get nine, you automatically advance. Go. Yeah. Oh, good hustle. Do you think there's a little bit of a disadvantage going first because people get to see you do it? Yes, absolutely. It's flag number one. <laughs> oh, we got one. Number one. Wisconsin! There you go. There you go. <laughs> Come on, you can do it, AJ! Uh, number two is quicker. That was quicker. Oh, she's shaking. Oh, yeah. Come on, AJ! 
I give her 10. I give her 10. Oh, now you're going to change. I said five. I'm definitely wrong. I'm definitely going to give her five. She's, she's smoking. Look she is. You got three minutes left, AJ. You're doing great. Woo! Woo! I do have my work cut out for me. All right. This side's Myla. That side's Myla. She got eight faster than Myla did. Let's we'll see if she goes on or she quits. Next round. Got it, AJ! Good job! You're automatically in! 30 seconds left! Number 15! Three, two, one! That's it! Good job, AJ! How about AJ, ladies and gentlemen? Huh? 16, you did fantastic. You doubled Milo. I know. It's nice to be able to watch somebody first, huh? <laughs> when you got nine, you knew you were in. What made you decide to keep going? Why you want to show the guys up? I don't want them to just wipe me off the table. I'm, I'm showing my strength. Really. Congratulations to you. You are in for sure. Now let's move on ah! to Katie. Oh! Any advice to Katie? Good job, girl. Yeah, Katie, you can do it. I know you can. Let's do it. Let's Come go. on. All right, what are you going to do with the money if you win? If I win, um, well, I'm getting married in four weeks. So, are you really? Well, yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah. So you're going you're gonna to hide it from your husband? That's no. a smart move. No, Dan and I will probably spend on a honeymoon or something. Are yep. you ready to do this? I'm ready. All right, Katie, good luck. Thanks, Joe. All right. So if she gets nine, she will advance, and poor Myla will go home with sore yeah. hands. After watching especially two people do it, it gets easier, I think. She can definitely do it. All right, here we go, Katie. In three, two... One, go! Wow, that's kind of slow. She's shaking. Wow, that's one. Three minutes left! Come on, Katie, you gotta move faster! All right, Milo, what do you think your chances are right now? How do you feel? I think I might be in there. I, I think, think you're I'm looking pretty good right now. I think I might be uh, moving on. I don't know. Here's number five. You got over a minute left, Katie. Come on. Here's number eight. Wow, she's struggling. All you need is one more. Oh. Five, four, three, two, one. That's it. I'm done. Way to go, girl. I'm very sorry, but we got to send you packing. I'm out. Take it Bye. easy. See you. See you guys. I was able to do something that I would have never normally done, and I did it good, and that's all I can do. I feel special that I got picked. Here comes the girl right now. You are stuck. You're awesome. She's calling you a stud. She's calling you a stud. Awesome. Was it tough? Was it, tough? Um, it was tough for me. Randy, you are the first Cowboy. guy. Let's do it. So you better Make cowboy up, partner. That's right. You ready? I'm ready. Let's do it. All right, Randy, if you win the money, what are you going to do with it? Start a horse facility for handicapped kids. A horse facility? What a nice thing to do. You just became the fan favorite at home. <laughs> just by saying that. A well, horse facility for handicapped kids. Kind of gives something to their dream, and it makes me feel good in the process. I used to do it all the time with the CRC Rodeo. What a good guy. I'm pulling for you now. Good luck. Got to do it. All right, Randy, are those boots going to be slippery? They're going to help me. They're going to help you? <laughs> you bet. All right, remember, you're setting the bar for the guys. You ready to do this? Here we go. In three, two, one, go. Yeah. Look at him. I'm telling you, that dude has got leather for hands. Ooh, look, he goes behind the back. Ooh, yeah. Crafty. I think those heels are helping a lot. That's fine, buddy! He said it. Fatigue is kicking in. 
Oh, but look, he's switching sides. What is he doing? What he is he doing? want that one. Oh, he's blowing him off to go to where it's more sturdy to grab him. Come on, Randy! Oh, he's got that one. Boy, he I don't know if he's going to do it. Yeah, he's shaking. Dang, Jay, he's going to beat you! You're getting beaten by a girl! 30 seconds left! What are you doing? Come on, Randy! Three, two, one! That's it! How many did he get? 12 flags. Go, go, AJ! I'm telling you. It's tough. Tougher than I thought. Why did you stop in the middle and then go further down? What was your strategy there? Well, I was trying to get to the mid-span ropes. Uh -huh. Trying to get the ones right there. I figured hopefully the wind would stop and I'd be able to get some. The boots look like they came in hand. Yeah, I was I was sliding on them, but you didn't have much balance with them. That was the problem. Well, congratulations. You got 12. Let's hope that's enough. Hope Andy, you ready to show them how to do it? You're Good my luck, man, dude. You're my man. I got a beat. You're right. my man. I got a beat. All, All right. right. Go. Let's that's go, Freak Show. Come on, Freak Show. show. Did you work out? Yeah, but I haven't been in like two months. So. Two months? Yeah. yeah. What about sports? Do you any sports? Yeah, I play water polo. Water polo? Yeah, That's I haven't done that in a while either. Mind over matter. What are I'd we thinking? You get 15. 15? Yes. AJ, you're the champ. What do you think? I'll go with, okay, 15. 15. He's Randy? Gonna He's gonna fall. He's gonna fall. All right, Andy, all you have to do is beat 12. You get 13, you will advance. You ready to do this? All right, here we go. In three, two, one, go. He's going pretty quick. I don't yeah. think he's doing it quick. Well, you don't think so? Choppy steps. He's he moving fast, choppy. but he's not gaining ground. Congratulations, you are in tomorrow. You move on. How's your hand? a little blood. Ugh. Ooh. Right? Oh, look at that. Yeah, he's Show ready to for camera. tomorrow. Show yeah, the camera. Oh, that's nasty. It's okay with me, man. It's okay. And now, it is all up to you, Chris. Let's do it! Come on, Chris! Get it on, man. We were talking all this time about your weight, about you're a big guy, you're very mm -hmm. strong, but the weight might be a factor. It's a lot yeah. of weight to carry. I'm thinking, because I haven't seen anyone that's within 30 to 40 pounds of my weight do this. So much pressure's off me now. You gotta beat 12, and you will advance. You can do it. You ready to do this? Yeah. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Whoa. He's the shakiest. Oh, man! 
He's definitely the shakiest, without a doubt. bouncing so bad that my footing slipped and I was going to try to pull myself up and keep on going but the ropes just didn't want to cooperate. He's bummed. He's got to be bummed. Good job everybody. You all move on to tomorrow and uh, let's see what tomorrow has in store for you. Let's get out of here. Come on. We're either going to be eating something or something's going to be crawling on us. Either way, you know, I've got to have my game face on. I'm going to be ready for it. I would prefer to have something crawling on me, to be totally honest. To be on Fear Factor is a big deal to me. Every night I watch the show and I say, I can do that. And of course, all my friends and everybody, yeah, whatever, if you think you can do it, then get on there and do it. Today I'm feeling a lot less nervous than yesterday. I did not want to be sent home first. I was real nervous and uh, I think I've gotten over that and I'm feeling a lot more confident today. Prove all my friends wrong because they think that I'm not capable of doing such things as this show has shown. And I just want that inner strength to show through. As you guys have probably already guessed, your next stunt has to do with bees. There are over 200,000 bees on that hive with enough combined venom to kill five horses. You will each be covered by those 200,000 bees. If you choose not to attempt this stunt, you'll be eliminated. If you quit in the middle of it, you're gone. But if after all the bees have been applied, you can stick it out, stings and all, for the entire two minutes, you'll move on to the next round and be that much closer to $50,000. We've randomly selected who gets to go first. Katie, you are lucky number one. Right, I know. How you feeling? Um, I'm not feeling too good. You're not? Nope. Nervous? Very. Really? Yeah. You afraid of bees? Um, no, I'm not afraid. Like I said, I've never been stunned before, but um, you know, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. I think I'll probably freak out. I don't even know if I'm allergic. <laughs> I think if she gets bit oh, once, I know he's oh, trying to scare me. Well, you know what? And then you're, you're really just competition to him. Don't listen to him. Um, I think I'm gonna quit. Oh snap! You gonna quit? This is so embarrassing. All the folks at home are gonna be disappointed, but I'm gonna have to do the walk of shame. I'm a big baby. <laughs> All right. It was nice meeting you. Thanks, Joe. Take it easy. Okay, you guys, good luck. See you. I'm very disappointed in myself. I usually don't walk away from things like this. I had to go first. I didn't get to see anybody else go through the stunt successfully, so it was kind of fearful for me. Now, Randy, you can't be afraid of bugs. Nah. You're not afraid of bees, I'm not right? Afraid of bees? You're ready to get this party started, ready, right? Yeah, I'm ready to go. All yeah. right, give me the hat, Captain. I'll send you over to Mr. Handler over there. All right. Good luck. Good luck. All right, what they're doing right now is they're applying pheromones to a shirt, which is a natural scent that attracts the bees. It's going to make it easier for them to apply all the bees to them. Now, I'm going to explain something to you guys. You have to stand there with the bees on you for two minutes, but it's going to take about 15 minutes to apply all the bees. Oh, the bees. guys starting to think maybe Katie was right? <laughs> Katie was on the right track? all those on there? All of them, dude. All, he's going to be covered. All of the pants? Oh, he's going to be covered. Covered, covered. <laughs> There is a very good chance you guys are going to get stung. I want you to know that right away. Look at him. Hands on the side. Look at that pose. How you doing, Randy? Man, this sucks. I'm a, I'm a little 
worry, bro. Cowboys hurt. You gotta be kidding me, dude. Oh, oh. oh my god, I'm, I'm so freaking old. This, this is not cool. Right, that's a lot of critters, bro. A lot of critters. It's a good way of putting it. How many did they say? 200,000. Don't just let it be. Let You're going to have a whole bunch of them. Oh. Oh. I'm putting my hair up. Can I go home? My heart rate is just racing. I know. Okay, all the bees are on them. Start in two minutes, please. There's a lot. Millions. There's a couple three million in there. Oh, I think there's probably like six or seven. See, that's way more than these bees. You got a minute left, Randy. How you feeling? Well, this this kind of sucks, you know. There's there's a lot of bees here. <laughs> I mean, a bee don't weigh crap, but it feels like I got 15 pounds on me. Oh, look at they're going in his ear. It's a lot of bees. It is a lot of bees. Five, four, three, two, one. That is time. This is actually very dangerous, so you guys really should pay attention right now. They're gonna take his shirt off because it has pheromones on it and exchange it for a fresh shirt, and then he's gonna come over and explain to us how much that sucked. How was it? Did you get stung? A couple times. You did you? A couple on the head. Got one right up here and one up here. I think I might have got one back of the ear, too. Oh, uh, it's pretty red back there. You got stung? Yeah. He's yeah. tough, yeah, dude. It's tough, man. When, they, when they're sitting there going on you, it's, it, it feels like your, your skin's crawling. They were so heavy. I, I mean, a bee wants it to weigh nothing. Right. And there's so many of them when you can feel it pulling on your shirt. Even with those earplugs in, the buzzing so loud, it's just... All right, Andy, you are next. That's right. Now you are wearing sunglasses that do not have lenses. Why don't you explain to us what that's all about? You know, a friend once told me uh, that you don't need eyes to see, you need a vision. Okay, your friend's an idiot. You so need they eyes to me, see. They remind me of just... <laughs> what? They, they, they give me that you reminder. don't need eyes to see? You don't need eyes to see, you need a vision. And I have a vision today. And my uh -huh. vision is walking away with 50 grand tomorrow. I'm gonna take those off, put some goggles on you, and cover your bees. Why don't you stand right over there, sir? Uh, all right. Good luck. Now, Randy, I understand you're missing your brother's wedding to be here? I called him up and I said, hey, you know, I, I, I can't be there. I got to be at Fear Factor. And he's like, hey, I understand. That's cool. Just well, look, better you, win, though. If, if you, you don't win, win you're Get him a nice so. prize. How you feeling, AJ? You're going to get the angriest bees. I don't know about this. Are you nervous? Be honest with me. I think you'd have to be out of your mind not to be. Really? Were you nervous? Were you nervous, no. Randy? I wasn't nervous. He's out of his mind. I'm there out of his mind. Yeah, I'm crazy. You have to be crazy to be on the show, right? Well, Katie's missing this for her wedding. <laughs> That's so... Oh, my goodness. I, I don't know if I'm sweating because of the heater because I'm freaking... Look at all those things. That is just nuts. Hey, Andy, how are those goggles helping with your vision? I can see clearly now. Ah. <laughs> Please. Yeah! Hey, that's Randy's line. Yeah, man, you got to do it more from down low. It's a gut thing. How you do it? Give me a yeehaw. Yeehaw! That's real, that's dude. Good. That's the real deal. How you doing, Andy? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. You got one minute left, bro. This is not good. Take it like a man, Andy. Coming up 
up on 30 seconds. Feeling good. You're almost in the finals, buddy. Yeah, it looks like you're feeling good. Oh, dear. Congratulations, Andy, you are now in the finals. Relax. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Sometimes I, I wanted to scratch and itch, but I didn't want to go there because I didn't want to get stung. When they're on your ears, it's no good. They're buzzing real loud and it itches and it's tingling, you know, it's something no one's used to. Yeah, I mean, I did what I had to do. You know what I mean? Well, thank you. Congratulations. You are now in the final, sir. Any advice for uh, AJ before she steps in? When you get bit, just don't move too much. Okay. AJ. I'm doing this. You ready? I am so Time ready. Time has come. Good luck to you, sister. Hop right. on over on that platform. Remember, guys, AJ will be getting the most angry bees, and she is last. And the later the day goes on, the angrier the bees are going to be. They really like you, AJ. AJ, did you get stung? Yeah, I think so. Congratulations to three of you. Now make it to the finals. You're one step closer to $50,000. So let's get out of here. Come with me. I think we're all equal competitors, but I believe that the guys are underestimating me. I'm starting to see that $50,000 now. It's in my reach. I'm feeling really confident about the last stunt here. I definitely think I have an edge, both physically and mentally. I want Randy to go first, because I'm more worried about Randy taking that extra step and doing it better. Today, I think the chances of me winning is pretty good. I think Andy's going to be my main competition. He's real determined. If it has anything to do with water, I know he's a water polo player, and I'm not real strong in water. All right, well, here we are. Three of you have traversed a dam over 300 feet in the air. You worn a coat of 200,000 bees. Now today, one of you is gonna go home with $50,000. The other two are gonna leave with nothing but blisters and bee stings. <laughs> Ready to find out what your final stunt is? Yeah. You bet. You're each gonna lie in that plexiglass coffin filled with holes. It's then gonna be lowered into the water and will slowly fill as it submerges. When the red light comes on, you're gonna have to figure out which one of the two keys unlocks the coffin, escape, and swim to the surface. The person who does this the fastest is gonna walk away tonight with $50,000. All right, we have randomly selected who gets to go first, and cowboy, you are lucky number one. Yep. How you feeling? A little nervous. Don't like the water much. You don't like the water? How often no. do you bathe? I bathe all the time. All the time? Yeah. You just do a little sponge bath? Yeah, you Don't know, go all the way in. the horse trough. Hey, man, you got to do what you got to do. You're on the trail. <laughs> That's right. All right. All right, you ready? Yeah. Come with me. Let's, Let's do go. It. 
You're a real cowboy, man. Oh well, yeah. Well, yeah. Why else would I look like you? You got a cowboy up, man? Yeah, I mean, you know how you long get a cowboy you know, up and win this my thing? My legs have been in shorts. They don't see sunlight, put it that way. They don't see sunlight <laughs> ever? You, can you see that? I mean, look at that. <laughs> They're quite pale. Yes. Yeah. All right, Randy, one of these two keys will open up the lock. Why don't you go ahead and put that on your wrist? I don't know about this, man. We're going to lower you in the water. When that red light above you goes on, work that magic, baby. Let's do it. Any last words? Nope. You ready to cowboy up? Let's do it. Give me some knuckle. Win some money, baby. Let's get him in the water. I got your hat for good luck. All right, he's locking himself in. Here we go. Cowboy up, baby! You betcha. Give me a prediction. How fast are you going to do it? 23. Not good enough. 15. Well, if I can shoot the lock off, that'd be all right. That's next season. All right, give me a prediction. How fast do you think he's going to do it? He can do it. If he's, he's not going to do it. I've never seen a cowboy swim. Relax. Take some deep breaths. That's cool. Do not touch the lock until the red light goes on. You ready? Wait, he's got the thing off his nose. Randy, put that thing back on your nose. Breathe out of your mouth. I can't breathe. Yeah, he can. It's because he's got his head up. Lean your head back a little. You can breathe out of your mouth. Take some deep breaths. Suck it up. Are you ready? Give me a thumbs up. Randy! Give me a thumbs up. <laughs> he's freaking out. Don't freak out. Come on, you cowboy. You're each going to lie in that plexiglass coffin filled with holes. It's then going to be lowered into the water and will slowly fill as it submerges. When the red light comes on, you're going to have to figure out which one of the two keys unlocks the coffin, escape, and swim to the surface. Are you ready? All right, thumbs up. That's what I'm talking about. Don't touch that lock until you see that red light. Do it, baby. Come on. In three, two, one, lower them. Looks like panic. He's waiting too long. You better take his breath. No. no. Hold your breath! Okay, red light's on. He's got the lock. He's got it off. He's up. 17 seconds! You did it, cowboy! The only part that started getting to me was when they lowered me into the water that first four inches, and I couldn't get a good breath, and it was wigging me out. Well, I was watching the water come in, and as soon as it got right to the corner of my lips, I took my uh, a real quick breath, and I actually got about a half a mouth full of water at the same time. As soon as I swallowed down, I closed my eyes. When I opened my eyes, I saw the red light was on, and I just grabbed the keys and opened it up. Did you get it with the first key or the second key? Well, I'm not going to say that. Well, it doesn't matter. They're, they're different for anybody. There's a second key, but there's I tried to put key. it in backwards. So there is room for improvement. Yep, there is a lot of room for improvement. All right, you guys have already seen uh, Randy go. Give me a prediction. How fast are you going to do it? 13 seconds. Lucky number 13. 13. Look 13. at you. All right. Well, AJ? Yeah. Are you ready? No. No? Yeah, I'm ready. Yeah? All right. Yeah. Well, come with me. Come on. You are next, miss. All right. I think Cowboy is bluffing. I think he got on the first key. Nope. Thinking about the money. I want the money. Did you learn anything watching Randy do it? He's slow. That's all you learned? What no. about when he was freaking out? He was freaking out. Yeah, that was weird. It was a little weird? I don't think I'll freak out. No? You good with cold water? No. No? I don't think it's that cold. Well, we're going to find out. It's a big difference between dipping your little toes in there and putting your whole body in there. Yes. Are you ready? No. No? Gotta put the hair up. Put the hair up? Uh, right handed or left handed? I'm right here. So what are you doing? I'm trying to figure out if it would be easier to like... Yeah, I think I'll go. I have to decide here. Hmm. That's how Randy did it and he was kind of slow. He was. I want to be original. Take your own path. This would be too difficult because you gotta... Think? Yeah. Is that the way you did it, Randy? 
Randy's what? not gonna give you any yeah. advice. No, I know he's telling us. Randy's gonna tell you telling. to put it on your ankle. All right. You ready? Yep. You're, okay, hop on in. All right, AJ, good luck. You nervous, Randy? You're on the bubble, baby. She's either gonna make it or she's not. No sense of being nervous about it. What about Andy and his water skills? You worried about him? He can swim. He can hold his breath for a while, That's but not gonna help it's not going to matter holding the key. All right, let's lift her up. Come on, AJ. This is it, baby. Suck it up. What do you think? 21. You got the most flags. Now all you got to do is get the quickest time, and you're going to be the champ. You give me a thumbs up when you're ready. This is it. It's go time. OK, here we go. Lower. The time to beat is 17 seconds. Come on. OK, red light's on. All right, here she go. She's got the keys. That's it. She's done. 14, 15, 16, 17, 20. She's got it open. She's popping it up. 28 seconds. AJ. You got it quick, man. I'm telling you. Tell me what happened. I was feeling pretty prepared. I mean, I sat there and I looked at the lock. I looked at what way to put the key in. But then when I got down there and the water hit, I couldn't see anything. Sorry, AJ. Did not work out for you. Bye, guys. We're going to send you back and take care. See you, AJ. It really doesn't matter to me if Cowboy or Andy wins because they're both really good people and I know that they're going to do great things with their cash. It's going through your head after watching her do that. I'm thinking I got to get on the first first key. Randy, is he going to get it? No, he ain't going to do it. Well, you're pretty confident, man. Any last pointers for Andy? Before? No. No? That's it? No. Where's the vision goggles? I Gave just, up on that no, gimmick? I just need him for yesterday's stunt. Oh, I see. I see. You do any water sports? Yeah, I play water polo. Water polo? Okay, so you're used to being in the water all the time, huh? Yeah. No problem with cold water? Water's your friend, huh? Water is my friend. All right, crunch time. Let's do it. This is it, buddy. Send yeah. that mojo his way. You got to send that negative energy his way. Nah, he'll pull it on himself. He'll do it on himself? Yeah. You seem pretty confident, man. Yeah. I hope you're right. Yeah, I mean, see, it's one way or another. It's either going to happen or it's not. For one, he's, he's, he's thinking he's going to flip the keys into his hand and it ain't going to happen. He's going to have to reach over. He's going to be in the water. Yeah, he's going to have to reach over, pull it up, put it back in this hand, then reach up and grab the lock. He should have it on his left hand. Reach up, grab the lock, grab the key, put it in. Turn. Done. Oh. The time to beat is 17 seconds. You are 16 seconds away from $50,000. Remember to wait for the red light. In three, two, one, lower. What are you thinking, Randy? I'm thinking he tried to take a breath too early. Okay, red light's on. He's got it. Stumble with the keys. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Yeah! Yeah! All right, Randy, well, you did it. You traversed the dam. You were covered with bees. You got through this the fastest. And you are a $50,000 Fear Factor champion. And evidently, fear is not a factor for no you. Way. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah!